business. <laughs> Okay, so we're back for the December fishing reports and oh my gosh, guys, it has been incredible. We have had so many wonderful families here. It's been a really big family December for us. We've had little kids, three and five years old, eight, nine, coming down for their first time fishing with the family, catching sailfish and Dorado and marlin. The plank, everyone's been walking the plank. The black marlin are here in huge numbers. The blue marlin have been putting on epic displays and the sailfish and dorado have been really thick. There's too many dorado, we don't know what to do with all the dorado. We've got a couple yellowfin tuna showing up, average size about 100 pounds. And so it has been some truly, truly epic fishing. For Christmas, Santa sent his jungle elves with presents for everyone, so everyone got their Christmas socks and Christmas morning. We had wonderful roast turkey and whole grouper for dinner. New Year's Eve, we had a, a beautiful pig and we had whole grouper again. Fireworks display at nine o'clock. It was just all around good fun, good fishing, and a great time with the family. What a day, I can't believe it. So guys, I'm going to talk a little bit about the fishing. We've, like I said already, the blue and black marlin bites has been epic. We've had a lot of people walking the plank and um, there's just too many to mention really. We had the whole Yaffa clan here, literally 14 friends all together, well family all here together, along with Judd Rosen and his brother. They, a bunch of them got to walk the plank for their first bullfish and Unfortunately, poor Greg Yaffa, he lost his 700 pound black marlin after two and a half hour fight. It was an epic fight and that is, that is an, an incredible, incredible fish. It really, really is. But everyone had so much fun. We had the Mertlands and the Atkinson group here. They got to stay up in the beautiful, newly renovated palace. And they also, father and son, got to release black marlin together. And it was something really special. Ludwig boys were back and oh my gosh, we loved having them. Brendan and his dad have been trying to get a black marlin and Neptune really blessed them. They got a double up of blacks, both of them 400 pounds. And then later on in the day, they got another one of 350. So Neptune was like, listen guys, you've done your work. We're going to give you the marlin. We had an epic day on the water today. Anytime you come in, after uh, eight or nine hours of fishing, catch five billfish, three blacks, and uh, a couple sails. It's just a phenomenal day. So, yeah, I mean, we even boated a double header black marlin, and then another black marlin right after that. It was a great day. It was a perfect day. Excellent, excellent, excellent captain, excellent mate. We had a really good day. Awesome day. It's just been epic fishing all around. About 16 miles out on the drop-off, we've been getting a lot of Dorado, like too many to handle. 
we've been getting blue marlin bites that have been very, very aggressive. And for about a week there in December, we had a very slow bite where fish were following the baits a lot, but weren't committing to them. One boat actually raised 11 blacks in a day. Unfortunately, they only hooked up to four, but you know what? Four is still a great day of catching black marlin. That is an incredible day. And so the fishing has been wonderful. Uh, the Sayer group had the, the, the grandkids with them. And we had boys ranging from nine years old all the way to three years old going out in the boats and catching their first fish. It was really, really special. And we love being part of that because Tropic Star Lodge is a family lodge. It's here for family and fishermen. It's by family and by fishermen. Fishing was amazing. The captains and the mates were really great at telling us what they were doing, how we were doing this. It was just really, really impressive. So after a long day of fishing, we would come back and then we would walk around the grounds and be looking at all the birds because I'm also a bird enthusiast. And so there was plenty to do. We took a little hike to a different beach. Um, it was just, it, the wildlife here it was incredible. It was just really exciting to be able to identify a lot of things like that. Um, all in all, it was just a really, really great experience. I feel really, really fortunate that we were able to do this. Uh, I mean, it was a great time. It's our second time coming here. Me, my grandfather, my dad, my brother. And uh, I mean, uh, last time we were out here, I got a blue and uh, um, my brother got a blue and a black. But this is my first time catching a black. It was 400 pounder, ton of fun. Um, it was great, great pulling in, about 20, 30 minute fight and gave him my all, it was, it was a lot of fun. Blue Marlin. What a day, can't believe it. Let's go tell this guy. Two 50 pound dolphin, two on the fly, saw the sail. Chris Pell caught his first Marlin. What an amazing day. Let's go tell the boys. Um, our media guy, Kesh, has been so busy. He's just been completely packed because with the video packages that we're offering, and so you guys are gonna get to see firsthand just what he's been able to do because the footage that you guys are gonna see is awesome. One thing that we really like at Tropic Star Lodge is the video package that they offered. Uh, it allowed all of our anglers to spend more time fish, catching fish, fighting fish, and uh, it allowed us not to focus on running around the deck with a camera. We're really enjoying the package and uh, hope that uh, everyone gets to partake in this in the future.
one thing that's a constant here is one team, one dream. I have very rarely in my life around the world seen such a unified team to take care of their guests. And it doesn't matter who they are or where you're out on property or if you're offshore, everybody here has the same exact paramount unification of service. It's, 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 it's amazing, it really, really is. And uh, I love coming back here because I get treated like family because the whole thing is one huge family. It started 50 years ago and it's still the same. It's just a, a, a few upgrades, but the, the, the thing that makes it so special is you're so remote in this beautiful environment. The fishing, the fishery here is the best hands down billfish fishery in the world. Unbelievable, the captains and mates are stellar. You're gonna have a great time. You're going to enjoy something that very few people don't get to enjoy. And the one thing that I wanted to say is that it doesn't matter whether you've ever fished a day in your life. It doesn't matter if you have been here 45 times and you come back, you're gonna have an experience that you're gonna savor and cherish the rest of your life. So if you're thinking about doing this, do it. Cause it's amazing and you will, you'll be like me on here just blabbering about how amazing it is. So book the trip, come here, see it and be one of those few that has taken the time to experience this beautiful, beautiful place in Pinas Bay. With December being such a good time at Tropic Star Lodge for the Blue and Black Marlin, the guys here in our tackle shop work really long hours. They work from 4 in the morning every day until 6 in the evening. So we actually have shift work here. And we go through just over a million yards of line a year at Tropic Star Lodge because we, we want to change the line out to make sure it's good for you guys. We are catching bucket list fish. It's once in a lifetime opportunity. And like I tell so many people, it doesn't matter if you've seen one marlin or a thousand. Every single one of them gets you really excited. I get goosebumps just thinking about them. And so the guys here are making leaders every single day. They're re-spooling rods, they're polishing the rods, they're checking the guides, and that's just to make sure the tackle out there is perfect. We fish with custom-made rod by Drew, and Drew does an incredible job of tuning the blanks that he makes for us. And, you know, average rod usage isn't that much, but for us, our rods are fishing 300 days a year. And so the rods really get tested. We've paired them with Shimano reels, and the Shimano reels are second to none. And so with the diamond moi moi line, the tackle that you're getting on the boats is absolutely fantastic. And it's thanks to these guys who put it all together to make sure we can come back with Grand Slams. This year alone, I mean, before, by the 2nd of January, because obviously now I'm just doing the December reports, we had eight Grand Slams for the season already. And we couldn't do that without these guys. And so we wanted to show you a little bit about what happens here at Tropic Star Lodge. So our morning starts at 4 a.m. down here. That's when the captains and mates come in, we get ice, we get everything prepped for the boats, and that's when the tackle shop also opens. It sounds a bit crazy, but every day the tackle shop makes sure that New leaders are put back if we've lost feathers to Benito or you need a new sharpening stone, anything like that. So we do the paperwork every afternoon and the tackle shop makes sure it's ready to go. Then boats at the dock around 5.30, 6 o'clock, everyone's ready. Guests come down at around 6.15 to 6.20, 6.30 and it's at 6.30 that we leave the dock and then it's off to go and catch bait. How you guys doing this morning? Good. Lots, lots of misses. Oh my gosh, guys, December has been fantastic. It's been the mid 90s every day. We have had a bit of wind, so it's, we've had a couple of days of choppiness out there, but that's generally what brings the black marlin in. 
So we're not too unhappy about it. But the swimming pool has got a lot of use. And everyone's been enjoying those Dorado fingers and just cooling down in the pool. It really, really is. I mean, it's brilliant weather. The fishing is absolutely mind blowing. And it's a great family time down here in December. So I hope you guys have enjoyed the fishing report. I know we've had a lot of fun putting it together and we can't wait to see what January has. So thank you very much, everybody. And please go and visit the website, have a look at our Facebook page, our Instagram, and let us know what you guys want to see more of. And we hope to see you down here soon. Ciao for now. Yes.